Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Busy Rosa here and what up all. So I just want to show you guys, I literally just dyed my hair again. Um, Before I used to have the pink hair and then when I got my job, they said like, they said like, oh, can you please like have your hair a natural like color? So I was like, yeah, 100% whatever. But I didn't realize that I could have kept the parts that I like bleach and like everything and I could have just changed it to like a different color you know what i'm saying but i didn't do that i didn't do it i just went all black again so i basically had to re-bleach my hair and she wasn't gonna just keep bleaching and bleaching and bleaching it because obviously it would take longer and then it was like only like 85 dollars that she charged me like the hair the hairstylist the last hairstylist that i went to when i got my pink hair she charged me like $400. So I was like, I don't want to get charged $400 compared to $85. So I was just like, whatever it ends up looking like, I'll be fine with it. And honestly, I like it. I like it a lot. Like, it's just, there is a few different shades. Like, I'm not going to lie. But, like, I still really, really like it. Like, and when it's like done and stuff, and when I put it up, like, I just feel... Like, it looks super cute. It's making me want to do my whole entire head. But I don't think I'm going to do my whole head. Like, I think I'm just going to leave it like like this. Whatever. I also got this little shampoo thing. Um, and I'm basically going to use this, like, anytime I need to just re-make it orange, I guess. Like, re like bring the colors back and stuff. But besides that... Today, I went to the gym already. <sighs> I've been feeling super lazy, super, like, out of it and everything like that. So, I'm going to bring you guys along with me because whenever you guys are there with me, it keeps me in check. That's what it does. Keeps me in check. So, um, we are going to go and make a smoothie. No, actually, before we treat ourselves with food, I need to go and clean my car out because, bruh, like, if you guys understand... You guys understand when you're in college when you are a college student or when you just have a busy life in general you let your car go so much like i have so much trash i have so much like just unnecessary stuff that's like girl like why is this in your car still like why don't you take it out and it's why because i'm lazy and i just leave it there and i think it's my personal trash can and it's not i used to take care of junie so well i used to get her car washes all the time like everything i don't think we're gonna do a car wash because it's been raining a little bit but we are gonna basically just clean her out and we're just gonna do that and then we can have breakfast and all those other things today for breakfast i think i'm gonna make um i'm gonna hang on a smoothie and i'm gonna have a um eggs eggs beam and cheese burrito bum because sometimes i miss my family's cooking and so i had to make myself like eggs with weenie and like put some beans and cheese and then put like in a little burrito because i definitely don't um have ch uh, chorizo or anything like that or potatoes or else i'd be having chorizo potatoes every mother effing day but we can't do that because we're eating healthy i'm just turning off the light so i can grab a bag and go clean the car Definitely feel like I'm gonna need a bigger trash bag than this, but I'll see you guys out there. It's so pretty outside. Lately, it's been a little bit humid and just like raining, so. Also guys, we figured out what we're gonna be for Halloween. Me and Leo are gonna be Joker and Harley Quinn at one party, and then another party. Um, We said that we'll do like whatever we want, like, he can be like whatever he wants and I'll be whatever I want. So I think, leave some comments on who I should be. I think I was going to do Poison Ivy or I kind of really want to be Catwoman. Like I really have been thinking about being Catwoman like for real, for real. But I don't know. So leave a comment down below on what you think I should do. I also, I low-key would want to be Tinkerbell too. I feel like Tinkerbell would look super cute with, like, the little skirt. Oh, guys, this is my new set. Also, I did these nails. And then I did um, a white side. 
um i messed this one up and i could fix it and just like fall it down and do all that but i'm just like no one's gonna notice so anyways let's let me show you the damage of what my car looks like right now okay so we just have like so much trash and look that little thing that was supposed to be right here always falls so yeah then we have more trash more masks and five year old drinks and yeah we, we just back there is fine but and then i just have like a bunch of like money and just trash in here from tips and stuff so i kind of want to organize it it's getting hot in here but i kind of just want to organize it and stuff and then yeah because i really want to start saving my tips and saving money because guys like life's getting expensive out here in college life so i just feel like i really need to start saving money like i also told leo what i'm gonna do to help and i think this is a really good idea so this is why i'm saying it so maybe if you guys are like oh my god that's a good idea like maybe i should turn that too or whatever you know so i'm thinking you know like when you go to starbucks because my main thing is like dude starbucks has a chokehold on me chipotle has a chokehold on me and like yeah like that's pretty much it like i just spend my money on starbucks and chipotle i don't really like we don't really go out to eat at restaurants or anything like that because we have food here we make food and we meal prep and like all that stuff but i do go to like chipotle and to starbucks a lot so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put a hundred dollars because you can put it into your app for like um people who go to starbucks often know you can put it into your app and you can just pay with your little app on your phone so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put a hundred dollars in there and boom that's my budget each month for starbucks that's it that's all i'm getting if i waste it all then guess what i guess you missed all your starbucks chances you know what i'm saying so i think that's a lot and then if i have more it like i'm gonna still put a hundred dollars for the next month and if it accumulates then i'll have like a little bit more you know what i'm saying for the next month and i could probably go every damn day like you don't know but anyway so yeah that's what i'm gonna do and then also um i'm gonna try to eat stop eating at work stop getting chipotle stop eating at school like i literally have food at home like i need to start you know making food and just like making what i like at home so i can take it wherever i go so yeah some little tips on how i'm gonna start saving money and also um i don't really like go shopping anymore or like anything like that so like that's not a problem but i already bought like all my books and everything so like that's all handled so i don't really have to be spending money one thing too is i use my credit card a lot so for the next couple months i'm not going to use my credit card anymore unless it's for gas then that's the only time i'm going to use it because that's a good way to use your credit card if you need to put gas but my point is is like i'm just gonna only use it for gas and like that's it because sometimes i'll buy like stuff with my credit card and that is no bueno so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna pay off this next like i'm over here telling you guys all my finances and shit. but you know what it's okay because if you guys can like relate to it or if it will help you in the long run like period but i'm gonna pay my credit card off this like coming up month and then for the month of october and november i'm only gonna use it for gas which should be also roughly like a hundred dollars not like because sometimes like i pay my credit card bill and it comes out to like five hundred dollars four hundred and it's just like like i have the money to pay it but it's just like do i really have the money to pay it like i should be saving that for rainy days or for just like in my savings like not have so much money on there like i should only have like a hundred dollars or so depending on how much i fill up because my gas sometimes like it takes like $93 or sometimes like I only fill it up to like 60 and they will go like almost full like you know like stuff like that so who am I kidding it's not almost full <laughs> dude this girl's a guzzler like that's all I gotta say but anyways yeah thank you for listening to my finance TED talk like I literally I've just been like thinking about like all these ways that I need to start saving money because we're moving from this house that we live at currently in may so wherever place we end up going next i need to make sure that i have a good savings i need to make sure that we have like all of our stuff handled and everything because yeah but yeah guys so let me just clean the car because i'm talking too damn much for the clip guys when i pull up to this freaking places i'm like I'm, a stripper. I'm just kidding no but literally i have so many ones
so I did like oh my god I'm so happy because I literally just figured out how because remember when I bought the little thing to hold my phone so when I record like I can do like my things on the car and like come with me I'm gonna drive here this that you know like just stuff like that and I felt like bro like I spent so much money and this this thing doesn't work well I guess what I was supposed to do there's like this little thing and I was supposed to okay so let me show you let me show you what I'm talking about Okay, so I bought this, right? So at first, it was just like this little plastic thing and I just stuck it on there. And I was like, okay, like let's hope it's safe. And it would fall every single time. And then I had this. Then I had this extra thing. And I was like, what is this for? So this is sticky too. So this goes on the actual car. And then this goes on this, like if that makes sense. And now... And now the clear part is not that sticky. Hold on, let me do this well. We can talk or whatever. So now the, the clear part is not that sticky. So I just put some of this. I put Gorilla Glue. And hopefully now it stays. Because, like, I didn't put Gorilla Glue on my car. But I put it on the clear thing so it can, like, stay. So, yeah. But anyways, let me show you the after I finally finished cleaning out my car. I had to go through a bunch of stuff in my glove compartment because I would have like, I had like registration, like, um, like things that were already expired. And it's just like, girl, like, like if a cops pulls me over or whatever and I hand him this, he's just going to be like, this shit's expired. Like, where is your car registration? <laughs> so, but I have a new one. So like, yeah. Uh, but let me show you how I cleaned my car. So I did a little bit of dusting, just a little bit. I finally put that up, so now, you know, vibes. Then this, and then I found a charger. So whenever someone needs to charge their phone, I have one right there available for them, already plugged in and stuff. Um, and yeah, I kind of try to clean this. I have my hair size here. I took off all the trash, everything should be good. And then I put um, my tips in this little bag right here. And then I have some hand sanitizer, pencil, tampon glue more hand sanitizer stuff like that and then i have like a blanket back here but that's just for whenever like we're chilling back there and like yeah and then this is the bag of trash and i found another charger so i'm gonna take it inside and use it because like i didn't realize i had so many chargers but yeah now juni is all clean and i can go and eat breakfast now that i know that she's clean and i'll show you guys what i make myself to eat or whatever. Okay, I'll see you in there. Okay, smoothie time. <clears throat> so I have this protein powder and it was ten zalas from Walmart. It's chocolate flavor. And then I'm gonna put some of this. This has cherries, strawberries, raspberries, blueberries, and pomegranates. Super yum. And I'm gonna make it in this and I have my nitro blender right here and we have the milk that we're gonna use. So First things first, I'm gonna put basically all the milk in there because I don't, like I'm just gonna use it all. And then one of these, scoop. I love that this comes with a scooper for real. Such a good. I'm getting protein powder everywhere. Okay. Lock that in. Close it up. And now I'm just gonna add like a handful of like the berries and stuff. I'm the only one drinking this, so it's okay. I do love the cherries, so that's what they look like. They're super good. 10 10 recommend this like fruit mix really good especially in cereal okay put this on I'm gonna put some ice in there just to make it more cold but I feel like the fruit is gonna be good enough okay I need this to close it's not closing Okay, 
and now I'm gonna get my Ninja Blender right here. Put that girl in there. <laughs> because it's so loud but we're gonna do a taste test i think everything's pretty much blended yeah the thing's amazing mm. oh i love the pomegranates it's literally like a chocolate strawberry protein yummy goodness that's so Okay, now I'm gonna make my burrito. Seconds later. Here's my burrito, here's my smoothie. Let me know if you guys ever make that smoothie, it's so good. Put some tapatio in there. It's a big fat chipotle burrito. Egg, winning, cheese, and beans. Mm, very good. 
Whenever I eat this for breakfast, I'm full for like the whole day. <laughs> Alright you guys, I'm gonna end out the video here, I just needed to do some things and I was super lazy, but we got it done, thanks to you guys, you guys are there pushing me, um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, here are the other vibes, and have a good day, bye!